Come on, you all look good. See, be out in calling a cock on the new goon hymn number 19. Only a cock on the new goon hymn number 19. Gio come in the delayo. Calling you all look bad. Allah, I am very only me. She will fair at the pot. Only you must shake when you should boo. See, bear, oh, fair, me laugh at all. Oh, you are me, no, she me. She will fair at it to be too. By your new day, be our summer. Don't you do do to so ara. Oh, do not see me lying there. You shall fair at it, Dara, too. I call S. E. K. E. K. N. C. K. N. A. T. K. J. We sing stanzas one to four and seven, sitting down. Hymn number 19. We sing the last verse of this song standing thereafter. We shall be led in prayer. Two, one, four.
Olu Olorun igbala wa egba ope wa Jesu egba yin wa adupe pe eyin na Olorun wa eyin le ntoju wa eyin le pe wa ti e tun bukun wa baba gbo pe egba yin wa adupe fun iranwo ta ri gba lojojumo adupe fun bukun ojojumo baba gbo pe egba yin wa adupe fun aseyori teran wa lowo lati se ninu ise sin wa baba gbo pe egba yin wa fun gbogbo aseyori ose yi to koja baba gbo pe egba yin wa adupe pe etun tin tesi waju lati ma ran wa lowo baba gbo pe egba yin wa olorun olore ofe atun ti de o a mo pe tin bukun wa lati ile ekojo esin mi wa loro yi baba e gbo pe egba yin wa bi se wa tin tesi waju ejo wa bukun wa e wa ran wa lowo e wa ba olukuluku okan wa pade e wa bukun wa e ran wa lowo ti wa leyin sure fun wa awon olori wa ninu irere yi jesus joba ni sure fun won jesus ti won leyin ma je ko re won ma je ko su won ma ba won gberu toju ile ati ona won jesus olukuluku wa o dowo yin o jesus ejo igbadura fun wa gbogbo ayida ayida ye e ma je ko gbe wa lo e fun wa ni isegun e pese fun ani wa munu wa dun ma yo wa kun mu wa sase yori jesus ante si waju agboro yin si jesus jo wa si wa leti wa si wa ni ye wa bukun wa wa gbala so di mimo fe mi mimo re kun wo san da sile pese fun gbogbo ani wa ye ka le fi aye o lo sile loruko jesus christ lo wa aruko e lowo olorun fun anfani ti olorun fun aloro yi lati wa si josin ni olorun loni ki oluwa ko gba be ko gba eyin wa we thank god for the opportunity he has given to us this morning to gather in his presence may he accept our thanks and praises akole fe ku boya ri awon ore wa ton ba wa josin loni fun igba koko awon ro won pe kon jo kon dije duro tori pe a fe ri won a fe mo won as we come on kwabo si arin wa we are expecting that our visitors worshiping with us first time are in our midst this morning we want to implore them to kindly stand up so that we would see them recognize them and welcome them into our midst jari lokun lo bere lo mo de lagba male and females young and old worshiping with us for the first time kindly stand up Jesus yo mu wa o Amen we trust that God Jesus will bring them into our midst ni agbara olorun ipade yo ma tesi waju papa lati owura ola lagun mefa sagun mefa bo ti di ojo saturday adura ro owura wa ni olorun yi fun gbe eniyan by God's grace monday through to saturday early in the morning at 6 am to 6:30 am There will be early morning prayer meeting here in the auditorium. Back on our knee, role, role, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, at a Friday. Our knee, a dry role, from Bogbeni or Lati, I go me fast, I go me J. In the evening of Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday, there will be evening prayer meeting from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. here in the church. Okay, I must be back, baby. wakati konkan ti ati la sile fun enikonkan wa lati gbadura ni gba ke gba inu wakati merin le logun to wa nu ojo kan pe ka mu wakati kan lati ba olorun so nipa oro orile ede wa ki olorun le fun wa ni isegun ki o si fun wa ni alaafia amen amen ka gbagbe lati mu ile ina ose also here is a reminder concerning the one hour prayers scheduled for individuals in various locations through the week Um, out of the 24 hours in the day god is expecting us to use an hour to bring forth our nation nigeria in prayer that god will give us victory and peace in our land in jesus name bakono ni ni ojo thursday wakati meji meji enikan kan bi a se pin ara wa lati ago mefa owuro si ago mejo asale e ma ka gbagbe yo wa bakono ni ose yi andupe la won ti won nwa 
ti won jo lohoto si akoko yen asin ra won ti won wa pe lose yi a o mare ti mo um we also want to remind us concerning the chain prayers of 2 hours in the day um we want us to make it a duty to be present so that um, we we'll keep to this schedule in our various groupings of 2 hour prayer meeting in the day ni ojo eti ti se friday awon okunrin won ni pada dura won lati ago meji la oru si ago meta lowo a o mare ti wa ni ojo friday ojo eti ni ose yi on friday the lord tarries um the main prayer meeting and the night between the hours of 12 am to 3 am we are expecting all men to gather for this prayer meeting ni ojo keni ose ti se ojo wednesday ani ikeko ninu bibeli ni le olorun ni hi lokun lo bere lo mo de lagba a o mare ti wa on wednesday also there is bible study for all and sundry in the church here we are expecting you o bere ni agbo mefa ni ro le ni agbara olorun time is 6 pm on wednesday ni ojo tuesday ni ikeko ninu bibeli gbogbo agbegbe wa o wa ba kan na ni gbogbo agbegbe ibi ta tin se ikeko ninu bibeli ni ojo tuesday Bible study also holds in our various Bible study centers on Tuesday. We expect you in these various locations. Lone, I want to do. I'm marche. It's a kale hirere. Lati jade lo lati lo kwe we to kani lati kwe amwe niyo. Wasi inu le josi yi agomiji. Si mi ji abo ni won o jade a o ti ma re ti won ni yara adura ni ago meji ni agbara olorun um this afternoon there is youth evangelism and we expect and implore our youth to gather in the prayer room at 2 pm for this activity where they will go out to distribute gospel materials the time is 2 pm in the afternoon let all youth gather in the prayer room awon odo ta so ni pe lati omodun meedogun si ogoji omodun meedogun si ogoji ti won ti ri gbala a ma re ti won loni ni yara adura ni ago meji osun the all uh, male and female folks within the age bracket of 18 to 40 years are expected for this meeting in the prayer room at 2 pm ni ojo saturday ni agbara olorun ojo aba meta a o ni itokale nrere lati jade lo lati se itokale nrere fun ni gbugbu agbegbe wa yi a o de bi ni ago mesan a o gbadura wa kati kan a o si jade lo ni ago mewa lati se itokale nrere by god's grace on saturday all and sundry are expected here for evangelism the arrival time is 9 am and then we'll observe a prayer meeting between the hours of 9 and 10 thereafter we'll go out for evangelism ni sade saturday kan na egbe kerin ni won o tun ogba ile olorun yi se on same saturday group 4 will take care of the church environment awon rudiment of music class awon na yo ni ipade won ni ago kan abo loni ni agbara olorun the rudiment of music class continues at 1:30 pm today awon ti won fe se idanwo bi won se ma lo ohun won lati fi korin eh ni ojo saturday ta pe ni voice test an re ti won ni ojo saturday lago mewa looro oni ma se igbarade fun iyan ohun elorin fun won ati mimo ohun itun ma fi ko orin by god's grace on saturday at 10 am all music students would who are interested for the voice test and the choice of a musical instrument are expected to appear here on saturday lale oni iyanu yo sele amen this evening wonders will happen eyi ni pe awon odo wa no ma gbode kan awon no ma wa su no ma se on gbogbo ta ma se lale yi amen a o ma re ti gbogbo wa ke wa o gbe awon odo jo nsun agbe nkan yo ni asale oni lati ago marun ni agbara olorun amen This evening um the youths will take up the service for us that is the evening revival service will be handled by the youths the singing the preaching everything will be done by the young ones 
we are expecting everybody to be present to come and receive God's blessings as he speaks through the mouth of the youths. By God's grace, next Lord's Day, our elementary children will commence their class at 8.30 a.m. and at 9 a.m. there will be Sunday school for all classes of people. Um, the young elementary children will have their devotional service at 9.40 a.m. And here in the church auditorium at 10.45, the morning devotional service will commence as we're having it now. And next Lord's Day in the evening at 5 p.m., there will be evening revival and evangelistic service for all. And after the service this morning, we will come forward and pray for a number of minutes. And by God's grace, at 12.30 this afternoon, we are expecting all congregation as we are seated now to gather for a special meeting. We have something important to share with you all. I want to be talk by Jagbe. One do call away your loan of phone at the lane. One about to see my man, one Mrs. Rosalind at Jagbe. Ne or joy to call Jay. Once in bad rap, eh? Bubua, Kyle, Fee, Joba, Rushe, Rejo. Amen. The family of um, Tokwe Ajagbe is greeting the entire church and appreciating us for the support that we gave them during the funeral of their mother, late Mrs. Rosling Ajagbe. And they are praying that at the end of our lives, all, we will all dwell with Christ eternally. If there is other, any other announcements, it will be made known. Promises of God. 
The scripture reading for this morning service shall be found in Psalm 27. Psalm 27 from verse 1 to 14. Beli kika fin se unro ila ore ninu in Dafidi iketa dini ogbon lati ese kini si ikerin la orin Dafidi iketa dini ogbon lati ese kini si ikerin la Psalm 27 from verse 1 to 14 Oluwa ni mole mi ati igbala mi ta le mi o beru Oluwa le agbara mi mi Aya tali yo fo mi, ni gba ti a wwen yon buru, a ni a wwen ta mi a ti a wwen abinuku mi, sumo mi la ti jè eron ara mi, wwen kose, wwen si shubu. 3. Bi yo gun ti le do ti mi, aya mi ki yo fo, bi yo gun ti le di desi mi, ni nwe ji li okon mi yo le, o wun kon li e min toron li yo do luwa, on nan li e mi o ma wakiri, ki e mi ki o le ma gbe e nou luwa, li o jwa ye e mi gbo gbo, ki e mi ki o le ma wè wà o luwa, ki e mi ki o si ma fi e nou didun, wo tempi li re. Five, ni to li kwe ni i gba e kwa ju, on o kwa mi mò ni nou agore, ni i bi i kwa kwa agore, ni yo o kwa mi mò, yo si gbe mi soke, ka o li a kwa ta. Nikba yi li ori mi yogbe soke gajwa anwa ta mi lò. Ti o yi mi ka, nito yi nò li e mi yo shiru bo ayo ni nò agore. E mi yo koni ni to o tò, e mi yo koni yi si o luwa. Seven, bò o luwa, nikba ti mò ba fi o mò mi kwe. Sha anu fò mi kwe lù, ki o si da mi li o mò. Eight, Nikba ti yon wikwe, e ma wà ojou mi, okon mi, wifun okwe, ojou re, olu wà li e mi o ma wà, ma she kwa ojou re mò kuro lò dò mi, ma she fi ibi nou, sha, inan she re ti, iwò li o ti in she, inan lò wò mi, ma fi mi si lè, bè ni ki o ma she kò mi, o lò rin ikba la mi, Te, nikba ti ba ba ti ya mi kò mi si lè. Nikba nan ni oluwa yo te wogba mi. Kò mi li o nan re oluwa. Ki o si to mi li o nan ti to. Ni to ri a wong ta a mi. Twelf, ma she fi mi le yi fi a wong ta a mi lò wò. Ni to ri a wong lè ri e ke di desi mi. A ti ru a wong ti mi. I mi ka, shugman, i mi ti gbagbo, la ti ri re, olu wa ni le ala ye. Fortin, duro de olu wa, ki o si tuju ka, yi o si mwa li a ya le, mwa ni duro de olu wa.
my heart, Lord Jesus, speak that my soul may hear. Speak to my heart, Lord Jesus, come every doubt and the fear. Speak to my heart, Lord Jesus, purge me from every sin. Speak to my heart, Lord Jesus, help me this Lord to Yeah. 
Glory to God in the highest. We thank God again who has gathered us together to bless us. And our prayer this morning is that His blessing will come upon us in Jesus' name. The theme of the sermon this morning is Walking with God. Walking with God. Let us turn our Bibles to the book of Amos. Amos 3, verse 3. Amos 3, verse 3. Amos 3, verse 3. Can two walk together except they be agreed? Can two walk together? Can two walk together except they be agreed? Can two walk together except they be agreed? This place is asking us a question. Is it possible? Can you imagine if for two persons to move together, walk together, commune together, except there is an agreement? Be a perfect bow alone. Automatic pay a word of joy alone. This means that if we want to walk with God, we must be a friend of God. Be a buffet cure. Go to book be why you are don't don't you pay any light about alone in life. I was in my bow alone in life. I got a jail alone. Kali ni book below the alone. Look me at me. If we desire to have heaven as our home or place of eternal rest, we must walk with God in this life and for us to walk with God in this world we must be a friend of God in this world so that at the end of our lives we will dwell with God. 
eni ti ko ba si lodo olorun ni opin aye yo wa ni bo miran ninu ise ati oro jesu ni je ka lo sibe yan amen this is because if anyone refuses to walk with god at the end of that person's life he won't dwell with god and therefore he will be dwelling somewhere else which will be in pain and agony my prayer this morning is that none of us will be in that group nigbati adam ati efa ti won se ninu ogba ideni eshu nipa ogbon ewe o mu ota wa saarin olorun ati eniyan sugbon ogo ni fun olorun nitori ife aye raye ti olorun ni si iran eniyan Oran Jesu wa lati wa ku fun wa lati mu ese wa kuro ki ota to wa laarin eniyan ati Olorun ba le kuro nipase bu won e je Jesu Christi gbogbo eni ti o baba Olorun rin yo je won ese re nitori pe Olorun ko rera ese eni to ba mu ese dani ohun ati Olorun won o le jo rin papo Olorun ko rira ese oju Olorun ki wo ese nitori na en to ba ma ba Olorun rin laye yi ko ba le ni ibugbe lodo Olorun 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 yo je wo ese re fun Olorun yo ko sile yo be Olorun fun anu nipa ibun won e je Jesu Olorun yo sha anu yes akoruko eni na si iwe ye ti ko ni pekun iwe aye raye lodo Olorun Olorun ni gbo se to wa to olorun ba jo bere irin ajo won be yo ni bugbe lodo olorun 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 jesu yo ro wa lowo amen we remember in the garden of eden where god created man he put them in the garden and by deceit the devil came in deceived man man sinned and he created enmity between god and man Before this time God and man were walking together but immediately this happened there was difference between God and man they couldn't walk together again simply because sin has come in and but thanks be to God that sent his son Jesus Christ to die for our sins so that he will set man free from that bondage that devil has kept man and if man obeys and listens to the grace of god obtains mercy he will come back into union with god and walk with god because god hates sin he does not want to build sin in the hands of any man anyone who is abiding in sin is enemy with god he won't walk with god and therefore cannot dwell with god but if we come and we confess our sins we repent of them we ask for mercy and god saves us he forgives us we have come back again into unity and agreement with god and we can walk with god we will walk with god through this world and have a place with him eternally nigba ti olorun ba gbo kon wa la eyi ni pe tolorun ba dare ese wa ju wa olorun yo fun wa ni odin won emi e e ti yo ma gbe nu okan wa Olorun re ti pe ka tesi waju ko n le mu gbo gbo ese ko n fa tu kuro ninu okan wa ka le gbegbe si aye wa mimo nipa iranwo olorun nitori pe olorun mimo ni olorun ha ese o ma nso ni di eleeri ero ese o ma nso ni di eleeri sugbon ti olorun ba fa gbo gbo ese to fa tu kuro ninu okan wa oko wa yo mo a o le rin ni iwa mimo pelu olorun odiwa emi olorun ninu oko wa yo tun po si olorun yo ma ba wa lo gege bi omo yo ma ba wa lo gege bi ore olorun yo ma ba wa lo gege bi eni keji e ni gbo se ta ba tun tesi waju ninu adura ta fa ra wa ru bo si olorun yo fi emi ekun wa 
emi olorun yo ma gbe ninu okan wa ogo ni folorun lo ki orun aha nigba na a o ni je tara wa mo irin wa ise wa ero wa yo je gege bi fe olorun olorun yo ma dari wa yo ma dari isise wa yo dari ero okan wa yo dari un ta nwo Olorun yo sakoso un ta nka Olorun yo sakoso ife wa Olorun ko jo ko ro wa lowo loni o Amen At salvation at redemption a certain portion of the spirit of God comes into the life of that man and he communes with God If this person continues he consecrates further for a total cleanness of his heart that is the root of sin needs to be uprooted out of that heart so that that heart is pure and ready for God totally he consecrates further he prays further and Jesus comes in again and removes that root he is sanctified he is made pure he has communion with God he is holy and he continues with God furthermore he prays further seeking more of God consecrates more so that he has the total infilling of the holy spirit the spirit of God comes into that heart and that heart is set aside totally for God this moment the spirit of God begins to control everything about that life the things he does the way he walks where he goes what he sees the things he reads the things he listen to the places he go are all controlled by the spirit of god her uh, such a heart is now in total agreement with god uh, if he does that continually and is with god grace will help him to dwell with god eternally our prayer is that we would have experiences of these things today nibi ti olorun ngbe nibi ti jesus wa ko je bugbe wa aye raye nigba ta wa ninu aye yi a gbodo sakiyesi wi pe a wa ni ogogo ife olorun fun aye wa iyan ni wi pe o n tolorun fe wa fun to n fe ka se to n fe ka rin to n fe ka dimu ninu ogogo ife olorun o ni le o ni gbe si aye wa wa nigba na la le ni reti wi pe a o ni bugbe lodo olorun olorun yo je itora eni je ki eniyan kan ko rin lo di si olorun o le so wi pe ohun nigbala ko ja wa pe o ni so di mimo o ni fi wo ni emi olorun sugbon irin e ise e oro to n jade lenu e o tako olorun o tako iwa olorun o tako n ta mo olorun mo ije wo la so lo nse o n tun ara e je ni boyo ni olorun nigba kan sugbon ni sisin yi ohun ati olorun ti rin lodi si ara wo nigba to olorun o de ni fi pa mu eni keni be mi olorun ba ro wa titi ta o gbo ta o gba olorun yo ma wo wa ni ran sugbon mo nbe olorun pe loni yi olorun a je ko gbo amen mo ni olorun a je ko gba amen nitori pe lojo kan ohun asun aye yi to le jo eni keni loju a o fi sile lo ha a o wa lo lo ibugbe aye raye yala lodo olorun tabi ni bi ti esu wa jesu oni ja lo sibe yen o amen orun je bi ayo orun dara alaafia lo wa ni be aye po ruru ruduruju wa nu aye ko si foko bale sugbon olorun lohun balon balon lowo lati wo ibodi orun tolorun ran lowo lati wo ilu orun o wo nu alaafia amen o wo nu ayo yes o wo nu ifoko bale yes 
fun ogorun odun ni rara o abi fun egberun odun rara o abi fun egberun odun marun rara o titi aye raye o ko si ekun ko si ose abamo ko si lorun jesu yo mu wa debe amen mo ni jesu yo mu wa debe ibi ta gbodo po nbe ta gbodo la kaka lati lo aye raye wa niye o ta ba se be olorun yo ran wa lowo o amen mo ni olorun yo ran wa lowo o amen sugbon be ni ko ba rin lo di si olorun laye yi ti o gba ko so lojo olorun ti ko gba idari lojo olorun wo na gbogbo wa la ni le ta ti jale lo ro yi be na bi be ko ha la ro yi kani koko ko eru de si gate wa eni ta o mo ri ko ni koko koko eyin ara le yi o mo fe ma ba yin gbenu le yi o se wa si gate e fun bo se ri pelu olorun na ni e eni to rin lodi si olorun eni to mu olorun binu eni ti igbesi aye e ti o do gba pelu imole oro olorun sugbon to wa nto ara e je pe ah africa o ba si awa ti gbadura pe on je present rapture sugbon o rin lodi si olorun ise e o lodi si olorun se yo lorun ni o nto ara e je ni Yes, Amen. If we desire to dwell with God eternally, then it is compulsory that we walk in His precepts, in His will. We walk in the love that He has created for us in agreement with God. Ah, but it will be total deceit if we say we want to live with God eternally and even claim to be saved, sanctified and filled with the Holy Spirit, yet we are saying, or we do things, or we go to places that are against the will of God for our lives, it will be complete deceit because such a heart, such a person, will not dwell in heaven with God at the end of his life. If such a person allows the devil, maybe one time he had been a child of God, he has been walking in agreement with God, but he allows the devil to deceive him or her, and he turns away from God. He allows separation to come in and is doing his own bidings. Such a person at the end of his life will surely go to one place, but certainly not to heaven that God has prepared for him. Ah, he will go to where the devil and his cohorts are staying. My prayer this morning is that you will not be part of them. I will not be part of such group. But a heart that desires God and walks in the love of God, in the will of God, is going to go to heaven. And heaven, you know what, is a happy place. When you get by grace into the pearly gates of heaven, you are done with sorrows. You are done with pain. You are done with troubles. Anything evil, you are done with it. You are already in a place of peace, a place of joy, a place of happiness all through your life. It is not 100 years. It is not a million years. It is eternity. You are using all your, the remaining of your time with God in peace and joy. And my prayer this morning is that by God's grace, you and I will be counted worthy to be amongst those that will enjoy life with God. Uh, let us consider it. We all left our homes this morning. But perhaps before you were living, somebody you've never met before, you've never seen before, you have never had conversation with, it just appears with luggage before your house. Uh, excuse me, sir or ma, I want to be living with you. Uh, I am sure, very sure, that you wouldn't accept such a person in. So it is when we do not walk with God, when do we, we do not live in his biddings, when we do not observe his sayings, there is no way it will be possible for such a life to dwell with God eternally. Therefore, it is important and compulsory that we do not deceive ourselves. This morning, we need to make sure that we are walking with God and in agreement with God and that we are living in His will. John Kini Ori Kini. John Kini Ori Kini. First John chapter one. Onkalati S K N C K J. First John chapter one from verse five to seven. Eyi si ni shetia wati bolenure. 
ti a wa si je fun yin pe imole ni olorun okun kun ko si si lodo re rara bi a wa ba wi pe a wa ni dapo pelu re ti a wa si rin ninu okun kun a wa nseke a wa ko si se otito bi a wa ba rin ninu imole bi ohun ti nbe ninu imole a wa ni dapo pelu ara wa eje jesu christi omo re ni nwe wa nu Kuro ni nu ese gbogbo amen amen first john chapter 1 verse 5 this then is the message which we have heard of him and declare unto you that god is light and in him is no darkness at all six if we say that we have fellowship with him and walk in darkness we lie and do not the truth seven but if we walk in the light as he is in the light We are fellowship one with another and the blood of Jesus Christ his son cleanseth us from all sin. Amen. Bi aba ma ba Olorun ni. Imole Olorun itosho orun to wonu okan wa nigbata nigbala ta ni so di mimo ta ni fi won ni emi Olorun agbodo duro ninu e. Agbodo duro ninu ogogo ifi Olorun fun aye wa. Agbadorin ni igboran si ofin Olorun fun wa nigba na a ni idani loju wi pe awa ati Olorun awa ni irepo oro Olorun yin so fun wa wi pe imole ni Olorun eni to ba wa ninu okunkun ohun ati Olorun won o le jo rin papo sugbon bo ba fi okunkun sile to ba sinu imole yin rere ti Jesu Christi iwa ati Olorun e o di ore e o jo ma ri papo e o jo ma se papo ogo ni folo loki orun nigba na la le ni ire ti wi pe iye ti ko ni pekun ti Jesu ra fun wa yo a o ni pa ti pin ninu e Jesu yo ra wa lowo o sugbon ta ba ta ku sinu okunkun ta ta ku sinu on gbogbo to se lodi si olorun ta nklemu ta nja jalanka to wi pe eh awa na o ya jo olorun ni ora mi o ma ntora eje ni o nitori pe okunkun ko le ba olorun be okunkun ko si lodo olorun en ti o ba olorun ni yo kuro ninu okunkun yo ba sinu imole eh eh ngba na lo wa ti olorun wo jo ma rin ni gbo se olorun kan na to gbe ni orun yo mu wa wa sodun ara re lorun lorun a o ma ba olorun gbe titi la jesus yo je ko se se fun o amen if we walk in the light and the light of god is in our life when we have salvation that light is there in sanctification and in the filling of the holy spirit the light of god is in us he says we have communion with god we are now a friend of god we do things with god we are in agreement with god we are dwelling in his will that is when we walk in the light ah uh, but if anyone is deceiving himself and is claiming or feeling important that after all um i will come to church or after all I do this or that for God and yet he is in darkness and does not turn away from darkness such a person does not have any hope eternally because he who walks in the light and is walking with God who has the light of God in him continuously he has a hope at the end of life that the eternal life that Jesus has bought for us he has a hope that he is going to share in eternal life with Jesus Christ Um, such a life would not allow the things of the world to take him back into darkness and therefore i'm praying god this morning that as many that has, are in darkness this morning will turn around and come into the light and have communion with god and walk with god and dwell in his will in this for our lives in this world in jesus name Second Corinthians chapter ten verse twelve. Corinthians chapter ten verse twelve. Second Corinthians chapter ten verse twelve. Ni tori pe awa kudasha ati karawa mo tabi ati fi arawa we awo miro ni nuwa tiyara wo shuba 
awon fun ra won je ara iloye nigbati won fi ara won di won ara won ti won si fi ara won we ara won second corinthians chapter 10 verse 12 for we dare not make ourselves of the number or compare ourselves with some that commend themselves but they measuring themselves by themselves and comparing themselves among themselves are not wise olukuluku eni ti olorun pe lorin ni waju olorun irin ajo si ilu orun ki se o ya je ka lo eni kokan ni yo pinu pe ohun lo sorun ohun fe fi orun se bugbe ohun paul apostle ni wa so fun wa wi pe a o le ma fi ara wa we ara wa ha eh lagbaja se bayi emi na le se ta me dun se bayi emi na le se mun da o leyin ta ba ni emi olorun emi olorun lo sakosu aye wa ha ohun ti eni kan se tolorun si nwo ran bi won ba se ni isin yi idajo olorun le wa soru ye lesekese ohun ti eni kan se ti olorun si gboju kuro nbe ti won ba se ni isin yi o le di wahala si olorun nitori na paul ni ma fa ara ewe eni kankan eh awon yoba ma n po we pe oni kun lo mo ka olukuluku lo mo bi to n duro si ni waju olorun o nitori na olukuluku wa la rin ni waju olorun ma fi ara ewe eniyan ma wo ti elo miran awon mo wa lede oni wa ni stay on your lane duro lori ilati e but avansa 100 meters ni gba yen ta wa ni lewe o ti e je pe mi mere sa pupo sugbon olukuluku won ani ka duro ni le ni wa bayi a wa sare ologbon rolo to ba bo si le ni elomi wa disqualify e wa lo wa lo mere sa wa yo e kuro ni be olukuluku wa la rin ni waju olorun duro loju ona ti e duro ninu tolorun pe e si duro ninu tolorun fa le e lowo ohun ti olorun ba so fun won to gbo na si ohun lo ma gba ere e stay on your lane ma wo agu ara ago sise ma wo agu ara ago sise ko ma ba pada nu ere nla to nduro de wa lorun jesu yo ro wa lowo amen when we are walking with god in the light in salvation, sanctification, and baptism of the Holy Ghost is still with us, um, we need to make a personal decision. Our going to heaven is not public opinion. Neither is it public decision. We are all going to heaven. Yes, but individuals would appear before God, and um, it's a personal decision, a personal opinion. Therefore, we must not make the mistake of saying this or thinking uh, Mr. A did that and nothing happened. So I can also do it. Um, what somebody did and God takes his eyes off for a while, a person may do it and he gets instant judgment. Another person does a thing and God is happy with it. And you also, um, and God is angry with it and you also do the same thing. You may get trapped in that situation forever. Therefore, going to heaven is a personal decision. And God is wanting us to make our decision strong and firm that nothing will take us away from the love he has given to us, from his will. Because when we are saved from our life of sin, we need to submit ourselves to him so that he controls our decision. He controls everything we do. He controls everything we say. He controls the places we go. And so that at the end of our lives, we will have um, union forever with Jesus in heaven. May God help us to do this. And the come and be belly. Eighty Mojobu Lapa Lapa. Ah, but you must carry to Mokaka Kaito, Benino. How will we not repay Kinney in your conscience? They will take you well alone. Call a commercial and all of all. Amen. There is somebody in the Bible, when I was younger, I read about it and I was amazed. How come a human would have gotten to this level with God? By God's grace, he will help us too. Genesis 
Genesis ori kanun ese keji le logun si ikerin le logun Genesis chapter 5 verse 22 Ina ku si ba Olorun ni odunrun odun leyin ti o bi metusela o si bi omokunrin ati omobirin gbogbo ojo ina ku si je irin wo odun o di marun din logoji ina ku si ba Olorun O unko si si ni tori ti Olorun mu lo ogo ni fa Olorun loke orun Amen Genesis chapter 5 verse 22 and Enoch walked with God after he begat Methuselah 300 years and begat sons and daughters 23 and all the days of Enoch were 360 and 5 years 24 and Enoch walked with God and he was not for God took him this is a man that I desire a lot. That I she on gbogbo kan rorun fun be ni rara o sugbon ina ku pinu pe o n fe duro ninu ife olorun olorun si mu duro ninu ife o ba olorun ri o gboran si olorun lenu to be ge o wu olorun olorun wo wi pe a eleyi o ye fun ku o to n lo ro sa wi pe eru pe ni wo iwo si pada si eru pe abi be ko olorun kan na lo ni uno ki a iwo yi o ye fun ku o ma bo lodo ni olorun mu no ki lo lai so do ara e ko lo ko ra wa na lo wo o ha uno ku yi eyan bi a wa na ni o baba le ba olorun ni tinu olorun tun si to be olorun le ro wa na lo wo Moni Olorun le ran wa na lowo. Yes. Kọlọ ko jọ ko ma sha ran wa lowo. Amen. This man in all his life is a life I desire so much because I consider it. How come a man walked with God for 365 years without falling away? Um, were there no entanglements? Were there no enticements? Were there no uh, would the devil not bring deceitful things to him? Were there no things that were catching his attention, things of the world? attracting him to join the world, uh, but he purposed in his heart that he would not walk against God. And therefore, he walked with God all through his life that he got to a point that God saw the life of this man in Enoch. The same God who said, Dost thou art, and dust shalt thou return to the curse he placed on man, is now saying to a man like us also that you, do are not desire, you don't deserve to die. And he took him away from this world without death. And it's an amazing life. It means we also can do it because Enoch was a man like passion as we are. And if Enoch could live that life, we also, by the grace of God, can live that life in this world. That we will walk with God without sin. And by God's grace, at the end of our lives too, we will dwell with God. May God help us as he helped Enoch. <laughs> Ora awon baba wa ninu igbagbo lowo awon ta fojuri ton ba wa gbe awon ta jo rin ajo papo ton gbe gbe si aye wa mi mo loju wa awon ton ka o ngbogbo si ofo ton fi okan si wi pese awon ati olorun ni o nko n ti yo ba gba awon ala won fe ba olorun rin titi dopin won duro a ri won ki se pa ka Shukma ari won eh Johanu so ni bi ta koko ka ni Johanu kini wi pe awon gbo lenu Jesu o awon ati Jesu awon ojo rin nitori na ohun to ohun so fun wa wi pe ka rin inu imole ohun to ohun gbo lenu Jesu lo ohun so fun wa awon baba wa na won gbe gbe si aye igbagbo loju wa won gbe gbe si aye ite lorun won gbe gbe si aye e to wu olorun to wu eniyan Ah, Colonel, 
oni loni mo ba eyo olorun pade kolon ko ran awon na lowo amen olorun ba ran awon lowo ti olorun ba ran awon lowo ton fi gbogbo aya won gbogbo oko won tele olorun ton olorun mu won laaye lo loju wa loju wa bayi ni baba so yin ka fese rin lo sorun oh olorun kan le ran awon na lowo sugbon a gbodo pinu a gbodo pinu gbogbo ohun to ko luwa lo ko lu awon na sugbon won duro ti olorun kolon ba na ba pinu pe a fe duro ti olorun olorun yo ran wa lowo ni gbo se awon na a fi orun se bugbe wa kolon ko jo ko se anu fun wa o amen we have read of persons who walked with god in the bible a mention is um, enough but in our lifetime we have seen people we have heard of men of god who walked with god and the god that held enoch held them therefore that god is also ready to help us if we are willing they also purpose in their heart that they want to have communion they want to walk with god eternally and god helped them um i remember a time at a family function my elder brother and my uncle they are um they attended that family function and this elder brother of mine has never attended this church he came to the mission house we came together to the mission house to meet um, um baba you know and after the meeting this elder brother called me aside and said femi i saw the spirit of god today that is because of the life he, of um, baba you know those were people who walked with god closely and god helped them through this world we are so many of them um in our very um eyes as witnesses we witnessed baba shoyinka also our former overseer who passed on to glory even he was sure that he was going somewhere to dwell with god so also god that helped these people is ready to help us and we have to make that decision and purpose in our heart that we want to walk with god and he's going to help us to walk with him. Olemi. Ijo wo le mi Olorun ba e soro gbe yin. Ijo wo lo ni mi si la torun gbe yin. Ijo wo ni iwa ati Olorun le jo joko ijo wo lo ti gboran gbe yin. Lo ni yi Olorun fe ka wa wa ka wa ara wa ri pada. Anu Olorun si wa fun wa loni Jesu yo ran wa lowo o iwo to kan darin buru lo bo se wu e lo lo le aye e bo se wu e lo nsoro bo se wu e lo nwuwa bo bi to wu e lo rin lo Olorun o si ni control of your life sugbon o wa nle ro bi pe iwo na yo lo run ha lo ni olorun fe ko ro ni pe wa da jesu yo ro lowo o my friend when last did you have conversation with the holy spirit when last did you hear god talk to you when last did you have that um feeling of communion between yourself and god god is calling us again to repentance he is calling us again to start afresh with him He wants us to relate with him. He wants to commune with us. Um if we do this, we will have hope of eternal life. But and but perhaps you are feeling it doesn't matter. You are doing uh, after all I'm saved, sanctified and baptized and you don't want to have a union, a communion, a conversation with the spirit of God. Ah uh, well, that's the seat because in the end you may not have a place with God. This morning God is calling us all again. to have relationship with him catalog badura e fi won oriketa ese kerin si kefa before we go to pray we we'll read revelation chapter 3 verse 4 to 6 iwo ni oruko die mi sadi ti ko fi aso won yi eri won o si ma ba mi rin ni aso funfun nitori won ye eni ti o ba segun o na ni a o fi aso funfun wo emi ki yo pa oruko re re kuro ni ni iwe iye sugbon emi o jawo oruko re ni waju baba mi ati ni waju awon angel re eni ti o ba ni eti ki o gbo ohun ti emi so fun awon ijo revelation chapter 3 verse 4 thou hast a few names even in sardis which have not defiled their garments and they shall walk with me in white for they are worthy five 
He that overcome it, the same shall be clothed in white raiment, and I will not blot out his name out of the book of life, but I will confess his name before my father and before his angels. 6. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit said unto the churches. <laughs> Thank you. 